Hi, welcome. Um, in this quick tip, we're going to show you how to get some images up on Facebook. I know f that Lightroom has its own published service to Facebook, but the, the only drawback that, that I found in that was that you can't publish it to your uh, private page or your company page or your business page. It'll only allow you to publish it to your personal page. So I found a program that a, a gentleman by the name of uh, Jeffrey Friedels, and I, I hope I pronounced his name right, if not I apologize, but here's his website and he has a, a free download uh, for a Facebook preset. Uh, this is the download and I'll put his uh, website at the end of this quick tip video. Uh, he does ask for a donation and if you donate within the within five days you're okay. If you wait <clears throat> past five days and you don't make any donation, he asks for anything, uh, which is pretty kind of nice. It uh, only allows you to upload 10 in images at a time. So you still get to use it, but you only get to load 10 at a time, which is certainly not a bad deal. <clears throat> Let me hide his page here. Okay, what I'm going to do is I've got three photos that I want to upload to my business web page in Facebook. So I'm going to select the three. This happens to be one of them. Um, and uh, this one here is going to be one. And this one's one. So I'm going to highlight it, hold my command key down on my Mac, and click this image. And this image. These are going to be the three that I'm going to upload. And all I did was click right here on my panel to get all three of them to view at one time. I will uh, go to my export panel. I am in the library module as you can see right here. So I will go to my export button, click export, and I have JF's Facebook uh, preset selected. Uh, and I'm going to go down through the list on how it sets up and then we're going to actually do it. Uh, the first little panel lets you visit your Facebook page. I'm logged in uh, in my personal page, so in a moment I'm going to make sure I'm logged in under my business page. Uh, there is no export location temporary folder or anything like that, and you certainly can put it into a temporary folder. Uh, file name, uh, if you're going to change the name, you can do it here. I export mine as a JPEG at about an 84 uh, quality. Uh, I resize it to fit the long edge at about 700, 720, and don't enlarge it. Um, screen sharpening, I do it for standard. I minimize my embedded metadata. And I watermark it. Now, if you don't know how to watermark, I have a quick tip that will allow you, show you how to do that. On this watermark here, I'm going to use my Facebook watermark. And just to take a look at it, we'll go to Edit. Mm -hmm. Well, baby, I want to wait on my computer. And what it is is just a, a light opacity copyright. And I can change the position and all that over here. And again, that's in another quick tip. So I'll hit just cancel. All right, I've got my Facebook selected. Now here's where I can tell it what album I want it to go to. Once I've logged in to my Facebook account up earlier, I can give it a new name and it will create this album for me. And it can tell me who it's visible for, friends, everyone, or only me, or whatever. Uh, I'm not going to create a new album on this one. I'm going to use one of my existing albums that I have. And this is the album I'm going to put it in, in Studio, in my Portrait Pros page. Coming on down, I've got three images selected, and I am going to visit the album after I upload it. I kind of like to see what's going on, and I check it, make sure it's on my wall. My resolution notation is at 72 pixels in the metadata. Metadata, hello. Okay, let's go up here and let's visit our, our Facebook page. Okay. And this happens to be my personal page. That's not where I want it to go to. So I'll come down. Uh, let's go over here. Oops, I'm sorry. I want to come down and use Facebook as page. I'm going to select this one here, which is my business page. And I'll click to switch. Okay. And I'm switched to it. And I'm going to minimize. Okay. I know I'm on the right page. Go back down here to my window. And everything looks good. I will now hit export. Now, on Jeffrey's page, he tells you how to load the preset and get it going. So 
I didn't cover that, but on his website, uh, he'll show you how to do that. Okay, here are my three images loaded. Let's look and see if they're on the wall, okay? Click right here. Okay, and here it is in my album, all three of them already posted up. Pretty cool. It's an easy way to get images up to Facebook. And uh, yeah, I do like his, pro his preset. Thank you.